Well, the city of Tempe is unveiling a piece of public artwork and Anita's spirit animal. Anita. This was your assignment, babe. So, Good morning. I just, I, disclaimer, I'm with Keith. Keith is not a short man. I just happen to be standing on a very tall curve. Good morning, Good morning. Keith. <laughs> and so this is a fantastic year. First of all, tell everyone where we are. Sure, we're at the um, Westside Multigen Center in the city of Tempe, over here off of Fifth Street and Hardy. And so you guys, a couple of years ago, built this amazing playground for the kids, really for all community members, and then decided, you know what? We're just going to make it all the more beautiful. Absolutely, absolutely. If you look at the space here, it's a, it's a large linear space with a large playground and the walls were just screaming for artwork. And, you know, in the city of Tempe, we're, we have a lot of, lot of public art in and throughout the city, uh, in, including murals, sculptures, you know, uh, all kinds of pieces throughout. So the mural that we're looking at right now is by an artist named Clyde Tempe Base, which is incredible. And so tell us about the process, because this was a process that once again involved the entire community. Absolutely. And a lot of things we do in the city of Tempe, we like to get, like to get input, uh, community uh, thoughts, ideas in reference to things to bring um, to, to the city. And uh, this is no different. So our Arts Commission works with our residents uh, and, and in, in this particular case we work with our kids and our community members uh, as well as the partners in our facility here to um, help us come up with a theme, um, help us select um, you know, the desired art piece that was um, chosen as this for this art commission. And, and people actually voted. They were, they were able to say, I like this, I like that. And so seven pieces were chosen and then the rest is in a really adorable and fun coloring book that people can actually download on your website. Absolutely. Yep. We have some hard copies. People can also download it on the website. It's something that Clyde incorporated in, um, you know, his draft, um, you know, artwork in reference to some of the things that are, are in the piece here in the mural and some of the things that aren't, but it was still part of his scheme of what he pitched and proposed to the city of Tempe. Let's talk about the theme because this is, I'm double checking, um, the girl who painted Tempe. So really, uh, Clyde was reimagining how one might experience the city. When you look at it, what does this say to you about experiencing Tempe? You know, Clyde does a, a great job just capturing all different elements of, you know, art. He uh, really pops out some different colors and things and really goes from the, the girl that painted Tempe to some of the imagine, imagination, you know, of a childhood preschool connection of, you know, the fox right. and the story and the, the boat and, and around the water we have in the city, the bicyclist and, you know, the backpacks of the schools here and also, you know, the, just relaxing and, and reading uh, with the tiger over there, which is one of my favorite pieces. Yes, and I said that's my spirit animal right yeah. there. I, I love the leopard and the tiger. So this is here permanently. Can anyone, even if you're not from Tempe, you just want to come and check out a beautiful piece of artwork, can they head over here and look at this? Yeah, we're working through that, that coordination okay. of this space. It's in an enclosed space in our pre preschool playground here at the facility, but we are working with as we open it up. And, you know, obviously we've been in restrictions yeah. during the last year of COVID, but as we move forward and having more in-person programs and opportunities for the community, we're going to figure out how to open this up to the community as well and, and let people come and see it. It really is beautiful. It changed the space. Yeah. Absolutely. It adds so much more. It's a, like I said, it was just screaming for, for artwork. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for what you're doing. Great space, you guys. So they unveiled it today and just an incredible piece of artwork. It's, it's fun to just walk and, and imagine some stories. You can do some storytelling here with the kids. Yeah. And beautiful detail, Anita. I mean, the, the images are so crisp. Well done with the artwork. Yeah, they did a fantastic job. Thank you. Job.